All right, how's everybody doing? Sunday morning here, April 15th. Uh, income tax day, but tomorrow is actually, I guess, going to be income tax day because it's the weekend. Anyway, we are out on the West Coast again. We are in California. We have just started our 34-hour reset um, a couple hours ago. We delivered down in Los Angeles uh, this morning at oh, dark 30, or should I say 4.30 a.m. Um, so we unloaded that and Headed on up to uh, the truck stop we decided to stay at for our 34-hour reset. We'll be here till uh, probably Tuesday morning, as long as they don't hold us longer like they did the last two times we were out here. Um, it's getting overcast. It was sunny when I parked, but um, I'm looking outside now, and it's kind of getting cloudy and overcast. The last time I was out here, it rained, which, um, yes, it rains in California, despite what the song says, but it's kind of rare. It doesn't happen all the time, but it seems like lately... Uh, and I come out here, it's raining, or it's going to rain, and I think tomorrow morning, or, I don't know, sometime tomorrow it's supposed to, um, rain, so we'll probably run into some crappy weather, um, for part of our break, but, um, so hopefully it's only, uh, about a 48-hour break, hopefully we reload Tuesday morning and, uh, start heading back eastbound. Um, this was a tough trip coming out this time. Um, for some reason I had trouble sleeping. I slept good Tuesday night, and then I had to flip my schedule to night shift, so Wednesday afternoon I didn't sleep so good. And then Thursday afternoon I slept good. Friday afternoon I didn't sleep so good, and yesterday I slept horribly. Um, so I'm kind of tired, but we got through it, and we're done, and we're parked, and we're going to rest up and relax, and maybe do some house cleaning on the truck, and definitely do some laundry and all that stuff. But but hopefully we get loaded on Tuesday and we head on back and maybe get back for at least part of the weekend. I don't know um, how it's going to work out. If you look over my shoulder right here, um, there's a dream catcher with purple feathers on it. There's a story that goes along with that dream catcher. It's not for me. It's for my granddaughter. Um, my daughter has a dream catcher from uh, when my wife and I got married. She's actually my stepdaughter. But when, when we got married, we went out to Arizona. Um, for our honeymoon and since she had never really been on the west coast we took daughter with us and she got a nice dream catcher well her daughter my granddaughter found it and was trying to steal it <laughs> and uh, so she's trying to tell her that no that's mommy's and this and that and the other thing and finally she goes okay mommy that's all right pop pop will get me one when he's out in his truck so and she's three years old now where she come off with that i don't know i never said i was gonna buy her anything and Nobody ever told her that I would, but she just come up with that one on her own, and it was just so cute that I figured I would actually get her one and surprise her. And purple's her favorite color, so she should really like it. So that's why the, the dream catcher is hanging right there. Um, that's going to go home and go to my granddaughter. <laughs> so anyway, um, since I'm on the West Coast and can't upload any videos this weekend, um, I figure I'd give you this uh, quick phone update and then... Uh, when we get back next weekend or early the following week, Monday or Tuesday. Whenever we finally get home, I'll work on the videos I shot with the GoPro and the other camera and uh, get them up on YouTube for you guys to watch and enjoy. So I'm going to kick back and relax. In a couple hours, it'll be supper time. I'm going to take a walk somewhere and uh, grab a bite to eat and relax. And probably tomorrow morning, um, I'm going to do some house cleaning on the truck and uh, get a shower and do some laundry and kind of all that kind of stuff and get ready to roll hopefully Tuesday morning so anyway hope you all had a great week and a great weekend and I hope you have a great week coming up and we will talk to you next week uh, once we get back home